Boom. <laughs> make, make it rain. Make it rain. <laughs> Break it down. It's your birthday. It's your birthday. No, it's not. No, it's not. This <laughs> thing and all your setup here, I have no idea what you do in your free time. I don't. It's scary, kind of creepy, but it's interesting. <laughs> what would you want to walk at? You don't I'm like looking at it. Hold on. Look at it. I tell look him to look at it. Just a drop. Just a drop. Oh, there we go. Okay. Yeah. Last episode on Clay's Automotive Everything. What's up, buddy? Hey, what's going on, boys and girls? This is Clay Holbright and Greg Mace over at Best Body Shop. Today, we're going to be talking about blends. Our subject of choice is on a 2013 F-150 that we're in the middle of a repair on. Um, as you can see, Greg's already got the thing in the sealer, and he's going to explain to you what the next couple steps are. What's up, everybody? Uh, right now, where we're at, I've got sealer spotted into our repair area. We have uh, a clear blender, which is DVC 500 and PPG, uh, put down over the entire panel. Not always necessary. It's a good, safe step to catch any small flaws or burn throughs. As you can see here along this edge, we actually do need a little bit of color. So that extra step of the BBC 500 was well worthwhile. What we're about to do is blend our color up into the bedside. Um, one of the biggest things that I've learned by doing this is uh, the PSI is absolutely the most important thing on doing your blends. Uh, if you look at your piece sheets, you look at what PPG recommends, they usually recommend 25 to 28 PSI shooting your base coat. And when you're blending color out, if you flick your wrist at all, your metallics are actually going to skip off the panel and give it that blotchy metallic look. So uh, once I get my coverage, I'm actually going to drop that pressure down quite a bit. 15, 20 PSI, sometimes lower, it depends, and uh, just slowly get that color blasted out into the panel to where you literally will not see where we've been. Right on, so we've got this panel ready to clear coat. Um, what we did, we shot the two coverage coats and then after that dropped the pressure way down, kept my hand nice and straight, blended it out blended perfectly. The paint on these cars is so expensive that that is very, very crucial on mixing the right amounts. Um, I think four ounces on a job like this was knocking it out of the park, and that's where we want to be. We've got the blend perfect, four ounces, we're ready to go to clear. Spaceman suit. So let's go see the end product. So what you see here, uh, this is obviously one of my favorite colors that Ford has to offer. It's a J1, uh, kind of a root beer color. But without our sun gun, you look at this color, kind of a dark maroon, almost looks black. Uh, when you take the sun gun to it, it just blows up. The metallics are just beautiful. In this Here's the deal, guys. This is the way it's supposed to be. This is the reason why we have high reviews. This is the reason why we call ourselves the best body shot in Wichita. Cause I'm